everybody. I'm Barry the Crab. I recently posted a video. Uh, I did some very poor lighting and her glasses showed a terrible reflection. And I struggled mightily with how I was going to get rid of that uh, without having to reshoot the woman again. And I'm going to show everyone how I used chroma key to make her, her that, that reflection in her eyeglasses go away. And let's, uh, let's take a look at this right now, okay? Okay, so here's our timeline. As you can see, there's a terrible reflection in her glasses. Just intolerable. Uh, it was my fault. Poor lighting. So I, I, I got to think, how can I possibly salvage this? Because she was an excellent uh, subject. So well, I thought, maybe I can chroma key out that glint in her glasses. So I took a screenshot of her skin tone. You know, I magnified it and took a screenshot and wound up with a photograph and here it is and what I did is I put that behind her eyes and we'll reduce this uh, I modified the image to give it I know that looks a little creepy <laughs> I modified the image with a, uh, a mask uh, this one right here stretched it out and made it follow roughly the the path of her you know she was the um, her head's gonna move back and forth a little bit so you want to have this behind her eyes generally wherever she's gonna be and that's okay there and I did also alter the image a little bit uh, her skin tone I made it a little bit darker and you'll you'll see why it's just it, it looked better darker than lighter uh, you don't even notice it at the end so I messed around with the color of that so what I do now let's chroma key out that glint in her glasses with the modify and I definitely want to get a good look at her so I magnify the image there's those there's those spots there enable the chroma key and pick a spot well a lot of that's out so we save that however now you can see the the image is getting degraded all over the place and if we put this you'll see it even more so Uh, this green there is around her sweater. Uh, the chroma key effect has sort of destroyed the image. So, if I take the identical video untouched and put it behind her, anything that I've chroma keyed out to get those glasses is now part of the image. I just had to shut off that green screen. We don't need that anymore. So you're essentially, you've, you've chroma keyed a, a good portion of the white out of this file, but you're looking at the non-chroma keyed original version behind it, so anything that leaks is going to be replaced by the file behind it. And the skin tone, what that does is that replaces the chroma key glint in her glasses that has just been removed and it works great much of that glint is is gone there but not all of it so and we're gonna produce this little file All right, so we're done. We're going to go back to the edit page. We have a brand new file right here. And now what I'm going to do, I'm going to take this brand new file and I'm going to overwrite that first one. Because this new file has now been half repaired. But there's still a little bit of white, a little bit of that reflection in there. I'm going to leave my skin tone right where I left it. I've got that original untouched file behind it. So when anything leaks through, it's going to be looking at this file behind it. And you'll never notice. 
So, I'm going to take this. I'm going to modify it again. I'm going to enable the chroma key. I'm going to bring this up so I can get a good look at it. And I'm going to pick my color. And that's not too bad. We can even bring this up a little bit. And let's see, maybe I can do a better job. You know, you don't have to do the first one. That's pretty good. We're going to save that. And we're going to put it back to normal size. And... And just like that, the reflections are all but gone. Certainly, they're no longer a distraction. I do not have to call the subject back to reshoot this. And that's a big deal also. It's, I have to admit, I was pretty pleased with how, how this turned out. And um, further instructions for the different modules we used here are available on other PD Toots tutorials. So this is Barry the Crab, over and out.